Hello everyone, um, I'm back uh, for the breast cancer healing exercise. Um, actually, I am going to start today uh, with the a lower body because we did upper body uh, last time. And we're gonna start with the split the leg and then lower your body. We're going to focus on today's exercise for um, adjusting our pelvic area and hip bone because our entire, you know, our body is actually standing over the, our hip and then all the rib cages is built from there. And if it's a rib cage is not uh, straight, um, Usually it's really outburst, so our organ is not in the right place. So we're going to have um, hip adjustment today, and then our rib cage will gently come around and to the center, and then that way our top organs are in the right place. So our chi energy goes through without any blockage. So we... Um, Last time somebody asked uh, why we have a small movement and a big movement um, divided by small, I mean the uh, internal, more internal muscle and then outside of the muscle. Because um, in our age, people are very disappointed when they're not flexible. But um, if you think that way, um, even if you make a small movement, you still have a stretch on, you know, inner uh, side of the muscle. You know, when we actually make the clothing, you know, the in shell is shorter than out shell. So we are um, stretching somewhere and don't be disappointed. And then we always um, exercise as much as we can. Don't force it and stretch and then we are going to put our both feet in the same direction and I call this is a mermaid and basically our side of the body which is a rib cage will be stretched out and breathe in and out we get very stretched on the side all the way to the hip to the shoulder and rib cage. All right, we're gonna try the other side. Make sure you breathe in and out three times or more. Whether it's just small breathing or big breathing, doesn't matter. You um, follow your body, body rhythm. And we're going to actually lay down position and stretch our hip. Pull your knee. This exercise is so comforting. Um, it's so stretched, but then your even mind is very uh, relaxing. Try the other side. Slowly get up to the side push the ground and then we are going to today uh, focus on our the hip bone the, a lot of hip times you know in an adult um, the hip position is like outburst so we're going to adjust today get okay, one leg straight out one leg fall to the out and you turn that side So to have, have this 
leg is very uncomfortable, but uh, children who doesn't have a crooked hip bone, they're very comfortable to sit just like, you know, without any problem and just they, they're just playing on floor. You, you see them many times in, you know, young children who don't have any um, uppers to hip. So this one is a little tight. So this quad area is very, very important to adjust this upper um, hip bone to a little bit more the right direction. So you can actually use your hand, massage, and turn to in more to in direction. And then you adjust and massage. See if you can actually bend it a little bit. And it's if it's a little hurt, then you just stop there and then breathe. And then you can go a little bit more down and breathe. Okay, we're gonna switch the side. Holding out and turn to that side. And massage again to in. Turn your muscle to in direction. And fold again. Okay, we're gonna try this time slowly both leg to be folded out and we're gonna lift and down and lift a couple of times with the breathing. Slowly, maybe we can count one two, three, four, breathe, one, two, three, four, down, and breathe. If you can't do all the way down, that's fine too. You just uh, down as much as you can. Breathe. If you could just down on the halfway, that's fine too. You just stop there and breathe. This is, you know, a lot of yoga teacher would not like to do that because they can't do it themselves. And, you know, it is, um, you know, hard to do in this position if you ever, never um, have life on your floor. Like uh, a lot of lot Asian people who, you know, uh, sit on the floor, you know, there are used to you know, folding their leg, but a lot of the Western people, they, you know, sit on the chair and sofa. They're not, basically, they, when they said what happened, hip bone is a crooked. <laughs> That's what happened. So it's very hard to adjust. But there's other way to do easier, you know, standing position. This is a very, very forceful if you're not you know, on that, you can massage on the side, quad area. Yeah, it is very, very important to have a right hip bone, pelvis, to have a right, you know, place, place in our, you know, twelve organs. So, this is a very, very good exercise. We're going to do easy position to release the pain. So we're going to just uh, cross our leg and then pull your knee. This is also hip stretch and also pelvic um, adjustment. Breathe. 
switch the side. And you can also stretch the neck at the same time. It's so good for twist. Twisting is also massaging your back like kidney area. And let's put top of each other and lower your body. And the other side, top and lower. Mainly we worked on today, hip bone and pelvic area to have a right uh, place for the rib cage and the 12 organs. And uh, always finally uh, at the end, we are going to focus on our um, the breast where we have a cancer and we're gonna circle again and we're gonna use the two fingers to just uh, self check up if there's any lump and cancer in in, in general they're you know same as us you know their life um, their life being and live inside of the you know the milk duck and then they are breathing they're eating they're pooping I mean they make a lot of gas and um, so you want to clean up all the gas they create and you want to make sure that around surrounding area is just to not polluted so when you just clean up and you will see a um, lot of movement, you know, you, you'll feel that. And then clean up the environment around there. So, it's so a little bit of sensitive area. You also focus and breathe and make sure they're all clean. And basically, if you you know, get rid of the pollution around there. I mean, why not? You know, the abnormal cell could be, you know, become a normal cell. So, don't worry about it. It's just, uh, you know, your thinking is the ma managing your illness. It is nothing to worry about. So, today's video is for the stretching lower body. But we're going to actually start next week to standing position, which is more focused on our, our hip bone, which is um, also very, has to be solid um, part of our uh, body. So um, see you next week. Thank you.